been a while. In recent news, I got super duper 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 sunburnt and I also got alcohol poisoning. Which isn't funny at all. I've made the conscious decision to stop drinking hard liquor indefinitely. So, uh, wish me luck on that. Real talk, it was super duper embarrassing. I'm not the type of person to allow those types of situations to happen. Therefore, I am going to prevent them by going cold turkey. And I'm okay with that. I have made a conscious decision to better my life and I feel like this is the next step towards that direction. <laughs> On a lighter note, it is hot as fuck in my house. My air conditioner is still not working. I'm gonna call the maintenance guys tomorrow and figure out what the hell I can do because I'm done being sweaty in my own fucking house. Since I honestly believe that original content is dead, I'm going to go on Tumblr and find a list of questions to answer because why the hell not? So here we go. Looking at your current level of intelligence and attractiveness, which would you choose to increase or improve? Honestly, you can increase either or. If you wanna be more intelligent, you can go back to school. If you wanna be more attractive, I mean, if you're already naturally gifted, fuck yourself. But if you wanna be more attractive by society standards, then go to the gym, you know? Go get Botox. Fucking tattoo your eyebrows on, like. That in itself raises the question of how happy and complacent are you with your life? And I would say at this current moment, I'm pretty good. Obviously, <laughs> this bowling ball needs a little bit of polishing, but whatever, you know what? I've struck out before and I'll strike out again. What do you feel is your biggest personality flaw? <laughs> what? isn't. I'm gonna preach for a minute. Real talk though, when you talk down about yourself, it's like a self-fulfilling prophecy. It's best not to make jokes about yourself in a negative light because deep down, your subconscious does take that to heart and it does fulfill its own prophecy. Better to say positive things. Let's, uh, let's rewind there. And fix that. What do you feel is your biggest personality flaw? My biggest personality flaw is confidence. I will proudly spout out the wrong answer if I believe that it's true. That's why I'm a Gryffindor, because I fight for shit even if it's wrong on some levels. As long as I believe that it's right, fuck everyone else, right? What is something that you do often but almost always regret? Bitch. I will go to work and I have an entire meal planned out. I've got all my calories counted, everything's accounted for, and I follow my meal plan and then I get home and I eat everything. And when I say everything, I mean I'll eat a salad and then I'll make soup and then I want a taco, and then I'm like, oh, you know what sounds really good right now? Some chips. Ooh, I want to order some pizza. And then by the end of it, I feel like a beach twelve. <laughs> Do you prefer to be the big spoon or the little spoon? You know what? I've always been the big spoon, but it's nice to be the little spoon, not gonna lie. Sometimes it just feels nice to, to feel, I guess, safe, I guess is the word. I don't, I don't fucking know. What is something that if someone does it, they immediately lose your respect? If I tell you that I have a problem with something and then you turn around and enable me with that problem, like, fuck you. you. Okay? okay? Don't be projecting your own bullshit onto me. Like, I am coming to you and being honest with you about the fact that I have unresolved issues and I'm working on them. And part of that process is airing them out, right? And then you're gonna turn around and be like, hey, that'd be like me telling you that I'm on a diet and then you bring me fucking cake. Like, fuck you. No. If you could make one thing happen in your future no matter what, what would it be? Happiness. Duh. Do you have an irrational fear? I have the hardest time with anything new, okay? Literally anything new. I get anxiety attacks when I travel to new places, go into new stores, new buildings. Obviously I do it and I do it with grace and poise because I'm a fucking adult and I have control of myself. But it doesn't stop me from experiencing those feelings. But I'm expressing them in a good way. Right? What is your favorite color? My favorite color is forest green and it's funny that my favorite color is green because my aura is also green.
What is your favorite planet? Mars. If you could change your name, what would you change it to? I would change my name to Melancholy. <laughs> what is something you've always wanted to do but never done because it doesn't fit what people expect? Honestly, my makeup video was peak fucking levels right there. People have always categorized me as like this like masculine, oh, you're, you're not that girly, like no, you're not into that kind of stuff. And in all honesty, I like being a lady. Why I'm a lady? I'm just a lady with short hair. So fuck off. When was the last time you cried? I was driving home from work and I was listening to music that reminds me of my dog that passed away last July. It just kind of hit me all at once and it was really, really sad. It will never not be sad, but that's okay. Yeah. What do you hope you will grow out of? Anxiety. I'm pretty sure it's for life, so. Set up camp, bitch. What belief do you have that most people disagree with? That the Illuminati is in leagues with the Freemasons and they control all the media on the planet ever. What are some things you would like to achieve before you die? Emotional stability, financial stability, happiness, creating happiness for others, watching my nieces and nephews like become? That's all I got. Cause I'm tired of answering questions. My goal for 2019 is very, 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 very simple. Make better decisions. And also to realize that it's not all gonna happen overnight. Things take time. Everything happens one step at a time. In order to achieve big goals, you have to start with small, easy to achieve goals. And then it eventually becomes a big picture. I'll, uh, I'll catch you guys. Whatever. Whatever.